Hey, you guys should check out Chase Beyond. He was last streaming Dark Souls. Thank you. How about a legit way to show support? In this video, I'll show you how. Hey guys, before we get started, my name is Chase and I make streamer support videos. I also stream on twitch.tv slash chasebeyond. Feel free to hit me up with any questions you may have about streaming, whether I'm live or in my DMs or in the comments, and I'll do my best to give you a solution. So, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a shoutout command in Streamlabs chatbot. So why would we make a shoutout command? Well, essentially, a shoutout command allows you to shout out another streamer in your own chat box through a clickable link that takes you directly to their channel page. That way we can show support to other streamers, whether they're live or not. Now, if you don't have Streamlabs chatbot, I've provided a link below in the description box for you to download it if you would like. Alternatively, I've provided another link for Streamlabs CloudBot. They're both pretty similar. I prefer chatbot myself, uh, but you may use either. The command we're going to be making today should work for both. All right, so let's go ahead and set this up. So first thing you want to do is open up your Streamlabs chatbot. Once you've got it open, go in the lower left and make sure, click on the little connections button there, make sure that your Twitch bot is connected to your bot account and then your Twitch streamer account is your current account. Make sure that you're connected to both of those. You're gonna need both of those for this to work. So next what you wanna do is you wanna go up to the upper left and go to commands click on commands and then what we're going to do is we're going to add a new command so hit the plus button to add and as you can see here you've got a bunch of empty spaces to fill out uh, I already made a shout out command so we're going to show you my shout out command and you can adjust it accordingly as you like so uh, I'm going to go down here to my so command and I'm going to edit that and so this is what we got so I'm going to show you every one of these boxes and what they do um, and you will adjust them accordingly as you would like. But I'll give you the most basic way of doing the shout out command. Okay, so we're going to start in the upper left field. We start in the corner where it says command and we're going to work our way down. Now command is essentially what you're going to be typing in to the chat box to trigger the command. I put exclamation mark so for shout out. I put the exclamations before my commands so that I know what is a command and what is not and I don't get it mixed up uh, when I'm typing something else in the chat. So you can make that literally whatever you want. I put exclamation mark SO because it's quick, it's easy, and you can get it out there. Cost, now cost, put it at zero unless you want it to cost any Streamlabs points if you use those loyalty points. Now having it at zero is great because we are going to be using it generally for moderators and for yourself because you really don't want to use the shoutout command for all users, but give the permissions to just moderators and yourself. That way that you're making sure the right people are shouting out the right people. So having it zero, you know that your mods are going to use it when they need to and you know you're going to use it when you need to. Usage stream chat, it's got a drop down. You could use it in other things as well. We're gonna put it at stream chat because that's how we're gonna do our shout outs through our stream chat box. Enabled, now you've got two options here, true, false. If for some reason you ever wanna turn off this command, you can click it on and set it on false. It will disable the command, but we're gonna leave it on true because we want to use the command. Now for group, this one we're gonna leave at general because this is going to be a shout out command that you can use across any game that you play on stream. You can adjust this accordingly for whatever games that you wanna play for different commands um, so that you can only use this command on a particular title that you're playing. But for a shout out command, this makes the most sense to be under group. So we'll leave it there, general. We're gonna go down here to permissions. Permissions, we're gonna, there's a drop down here, but you wanna leave it at moderator. That way only you and your moderators can use the shout out command. As I said before, 
Uh, it's just so that we reduce the amount of self-promotion in the chat by your other users because you don't want every user in your chat to be able to use the shout out command. That would be bad news. Also, this info box right here, you can't really put anything in there. Uh, the reason why is because the permission is set to moderator. If you have it set to something else in here, it may change that box for a different value, but it doesn't apply here, so don't worry about that. So for cooldowns, this first slider over here, this is going to adjust the cooldown of how often the command can be used. I like to use it at zero because that way we can shout out multiple people if we need to and not have to wait a certain amount of time before we can shout out another person again. User cooldown, if a user uses the, the shout out command, um, this will set a cooldown timer on them from using any other commands for 10 minutes, say, if we have it at 10, but we're gonna leave that at zero because we wanna follow the same rules as our cooldown in minutes, zero, zero. Now, actions, this is the most important part. So, uh, to make the shout out command work, you have three essential parts. You can actually take some of the parts out if you'd like, but I like to put more detail into my shout outs. So you see how I have it as please check out uh, target name at URL, an awesome streamer with awesome content, they were last streaming game. As you notice, there's dollar signs in front of target name, URL, and game. Now what those dollar signs will do, if you, let's just say this is a my chat box right here, everything past this point. If I do my command SO, and then you put a space after, and then let's just say there's a streamer named me. So we'll type in me. If I do that shout out command, it will shout them out with this exact response and this dollar sign target name will um, we'll say, please check out me as the dollar sign target name. It'll change in the chat box at URL dollar sign URL that dollar sign URL will give them the link to their channel. It will give the chat the link to their channel. And then an awesome streamer with awesome content. They were last streaming dollar sign game. So the dollar sign goes back to the target as well. Me, me was last streaming what game? What was the last game that they were streaming? That will show up in the dollar sign game. So we'll delete this extra right here, this extra tail end and uh, leave it at that. And then for the sound file, this is if you want to play a sound file that you've already set up in your Streamlabs chatbot uh, every time that you do the command. And then once you fill out everything, hit submit. And that'll save it. And now it should be in your list of commands. And it shows all the details in here, what it says, and whether or not it's enabled. You can also toggle it on or off enabled if you want to enable it or disable it. Okay, so now let's put this bad boy to action. Let's go into our chat box on Twitch, whether your stream manager or on your channel chat page. And we're going to type in our command. So exclamation mark SO or whatever you called it space and then we do a streamer's name. So for this one, we'll do Mr. Cools. We'll put that one in and then you press enter. And then as long as your Streamlabs chatbot is online, it should put out your brand new command that you typed in. So it says, please check out Mr. Cools at there's his Twitch link page, an awesome stream with awesome content. They were last streaming Jackbox party packs. So you can see that uh, the dollar signs, the three dollar sign words that you had in there, they've changed. Uh, name, dollar sign name, Mr. Cools, dollar sign URL turned into a clickable link, and then dollar sign game turned into Jackbox Party Packs, the game that he was last playing. So that's it. Pretty simple. Nice little shout out command that you and your mods can use. Shouting out is a great way to show appreciation and support for other streamers, whether they showed up with a big old raid or you just like them. Keep in mind that shouting out builds more value and respect towards your own community. So why not do it? Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, feel free to check us out at twitch.tv slash chasebeyond. 
We stream there pretty darn often. So come on down, say hi, that'd be awesome. And of course, if you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to hit that like, hit that subscribe, and I will catch you on the next one. I don't know. I don't know where, where the ghost is. I love it. <laughs> it's the crab walk. Crab walk. Crab crab walk. <laughs>